That crash happened on Old San Pasqual Road. Uh, there is a memorial for Jonah uh, here behind me where that truck ended up. Now, those who knew him say he was incredible, both on and off the football field. 18 year old Jonah Stabell, number 33 on Classical Academy High School's football team. A big guy with an even bigger heart. Something for the camera. The high school senior had planned to study engineering in college. So, this is our weight room. We had Jonah every fourth period for weights. Football coach Tim Sherlock. He always found a way to make things about other people and not himself. Saturday, tragedy hit the team. Jonah and six friends, many of them football players, were in this truck. The CHP says the driver was speeding, lost control, and Jonah and four others were thrown out of the bed of the pickup. Sadly, Jonah did not survive. And here at the accident scene, you can see the tire markings in the road. Now, the truck was headed north here on Old San Pasqual Road. It veered off the side of the road and ended up here in this ditch where you can see the memorial sits right now. Very saddened and, and shocked. Principal Dana Moen says Jonah's parents want the community to know. That they love all of the students involved in this, in this accident and that they will continue to love them. These were some of Jonah's best friends and the, the families really um, just reaching out to the other families. According to a GoFundMe page, Jonah was the youngest of four. His older brother passed away in 2015 and his grandmother passed away today. Coach Sherlock says Jonah always went out of his way to find the people who needed a friend, and his absence will be felt in this community. He was one of our captains, and uh, we had a captain's meeting in this room every Monday, and every time he walked in the door with his backwards hat on, and uh, again, big defensive lineman, but a huge smile. Hey, Coach, uh, he was a joy and he was a light in the world, and he'll be missed for that. And we are told that the other teenagers who were involved in this crash uh, suffered moderate to, to minor injuries and that they're uh, fortunately going to be okay.